Yo boys, what is going on? Welcome back. It's been a couple days. Um, it's been super busy. Reviews are going to be coming. We are going to be doing after this review, a couple more team of the reviews and tomorrow or late tonight, it may be a double upload. It's probably gonna be like 16 hours after this upload. We're going to be reviewing a moment Ziyech, hopefully. So that's the plan. Uh, he's a weekly objective. I know there's like three days left. So I know a lot of you guys want to know how he is. We're going to test them out. But this has been one of my highly most requested reviews ever because people want to know how is Team of the Year Ronaldo compared to Team of the Year Mbappe? Um, it's going to be super interesting to see how he is. If you guys enjoyed the video today, drop a thumbs up. Uh, they support the videos a ton. So just thank you guys to everybody who watches them and all that. Um, Cristiano Ronaldo, man. I'm not a huge fan of his card this year at all. So this for me is going to be interesting because they gave him one of the most god tier boosts of all time. He's got a plus five on his inform. Um, it's got an insane, insane card. In terms of the traits, he's got outside foot shot trait, no finesse shot trait. Now, 97 pace, 99 shooting, 92 passing, 98 dribbling, 95 physical, 99 overall. One of the three this year with Virgil van Dijk and Lionel Messi. So one of the three this year, guys, in terms of the 99 overalls. He's going to cost you close to 7 million coins. Uh, he's between 6.5 on Xbox. I think he's like 5.5. He's got high-low work rates, which for a striker is fantastic. Uh, he's got a four-star weak foot and five-star skills, which you guys know I love five-star skills. So that's very good to see as well. Got the beautiful car design. Um, he's got 95 acceleration with 98 sprint speed. <laughs> this is where it gets crazy. 99 attack positioning, 99 finishing, 99 shot power, 98 long shots, um, 92 volleys, 90 penalties. He's got 92 vision with 94 crossing. He's got 90 curve, 93 short passing. And what I really like about this card is that they made his agility, his balance, and his passing way better than his goal card which in my opinion is what he really lacked with. So he's got 93 short passing, 86 long passing, 95 agility, 78 balance. 78 balance is the only stat on this card that is bad. Um, but other things to compensate for that, the fact that he's got 99 reactions, 99 ball control, 98 dribbling, uh, 99 composure, 95 agility obviously is just also insane. I think we already talked about that, but it's a great stat to have. He's got 99 heading accuracy, 99 jumping, although I don't know how good that is in this year's game because I don't cross the ball too often. So I don't know how good that's going to make him feel. 99 stamina and 95 strength as well. So what is really good about this card? Should score almost everything you shoot and should not lose the ball because of his high strength, his high agility, and his height. He's got six, he's six foot two with 95 agility and 95 strength. He should be a force to be reckoned with. It should be a ridiculous card. Um, in terms of chemistry style, I'm not all that sure what to play on him because I've never really used uh, a card like this. For Messi and Mbappe, when we had looked at it, um, it looked like the best thing to go for it was going to be... Uh, it looked like uh, basics do really well uh, on these types of cards, but obviously I can't confirm that. So we're going to put Ronaldo into the team. And I want to see in the squad what Ronaldo looks like with a basic. So I think we're going to give him an engine. Um, and I think the reason why you would always give a card like Cristiano Ronaldo um, an engine card is because it's going to boost his balance. Um, and it's going to boost his acceleration, which are not low, but his lowest stats. So with the engine chemistry style, guys, Ronaldo pushes up to 99 acceleration, 99 sprint speed. He also pushes up to 99 agility. 88 balance and then he's got the passing which goes to 98 short and 96 long which is sick so really nice stats all around the board for Ronaldo with this proper chemistry style I'd say you guys totally do an engine you don't even have anything else to boost but it looks like the engine chemistry style is going to be the best chemistry style for Cristiano Ronaldo I don't see a better one um, at the moment it looks like this is going to be the one if you were to put one on Ronaldo it should be the engine and I'm super stoked to play with him today. We've got a team where we're going to line up with the Serie A squad. Obviously, this is on our review account. Um, but we've got some players that I really like in this team. We're going to play division rivals. Um, I love De Bruyne. I love Silva. I love Douglas Costa. Allen is one of the best players in the game in terms of value. Uh, we've got a Marcelo that we're going to kind of use. So you guys might see some glimpses of him in the video today. D Desai, Davinson Sanchez. I haven't used Sanchez much today or, or just in general, but we'll see how he plays. I like Cancelo as well. The way we're going to set it up with Ronaldo, and if you use Ronaldo, you should use Ronaldo in a one striker formation, in my opinion, because of the stats that he possesses, right? He has the amazing, amazing, amazing... Um, strength and hold up play and I think that's something that's so important with him I'm also not going to keep him on getting behind uh because I want Ronaldo to be kind of holding the ball up a tad I don't want him to be running away from the ball necessarily and then also what we're going to make sure we do is we're going to play De Bruyne at right attacking mid which is where I really enjoyed him 
when I first got him, uh, you know, into my team on Friday when I used the full team of the year team. Also, thank you guys for the support on that video as well because that video has over 100,000 views. And you guys are just supporting these videos so much on this channel. It's kind of overwhelming. Um, so just thank you guys, and I'm glad you guys are enjoying them. We're going to pick up the reviews a lot. We're Guys, we are at 18-14 skill rating, um, so somewhat competitive uh, at the skill rating. I don't know how many people are going to be on FIFA today because it is kind of that team of the year hangover. It's a Tuesday, uh, but we'll see, and we will search for a game when we get one, guys. I will let you guys know, and uh, we will see who we're matched up against. Okay, guys, our first upcoming opponent uh, looks like he has a 4-3-1-2. He's got Red Ben Yetter. Um, he is going for the Area Divisi objective. So I'm not sure if he needs the wins. What we will do is if he sticks around, we will let him win the game. Um, is what I'll try to do. I'll try to make sure this guy gets the win. I also know that he needs to get a certain amount of three balls. I don't really know the exact objective as I'm going to tackle this in a, in, a, in a little while. But uh, we will let him win the game for sure. We just want to play it out to test out Ronaldo. And let's get into it. We already go down 1-0, guys. Uh, he has a nice little attack through the middle. And uh, scores with Malin, a week one card. And we are losing. And now Bernardo Silva. All right. Feels ridiculously agile right away. Um, way more agile than the card I had used previously. So they've definitely given this guy a, just a massive agility boost. Go, Ronaldo. And he could get away here. Wow. Just like that, boys, we are tied up. Cristiano Ronaldo with his first goal for the club. And, and guys, we are going to be sitting here today wondering, is this guy the best player in the game? We have to compare him to the likes of Mbappe, who I felt like was a little bit better than Messi in terms of overall boosts and worth it for the price. So that's who we're kind of seeing today. How does he compare to Mbappe? Um, and, yeah. What a pass. It's got to be onside. This card is ridiculous, man. Oh, my Lord. <laughs> this card is ridiculous. It, it's so, like, insane, his strength and how quick he feels as well, which is something I've really never experienced with Ronaldo. Uh, even in last FIFA, I felt like he was even a little bit slow last year. So that is a... Unlucky. Nice defending there from Longley. You can see the movement with Ronaldo is absolutely fantastic, though. The way he moves is crazy. Nice pass there from Ronaldo. Bernardo Silva. Oh! <laughs> he misses the shot there. Nice pass, though, from Ronaldo there. Oh, my God. Oh, I think that was going in if Ron didn't block it. I'm not sure. You can never know, though. Oh my god. No! So close. Keep going, Ronaldo. Oh, so close, man. I almost had a really nice goal there. Probably should have just shot it first time after the flick, but. Nice ball from Ronaldo. Oh, so unlucky. We hit the post, but we get a rebound with Bernardo Silva. And he's going to put us one ahead. I'm also trying to score that driven shot so we can get the loan. What is Bernardo Silva doing? What is going on? I'm trying to get the driven shot so we can get the loan ZH. I think you have to score a driven shot in rivals. So I'm not sure if that was it, but I think that was it. So I'm going to try to do that as well uh, at some point in the in the video. We got to score a goal with a driven. And it'll be a good way to test out the driven shot on the card. See you, long lay. Move your keeper. Oh, Ronaldo. With the driven shot of dreams, dude. He just, dude, that went flying in. This card is ridiculous, man. I feel like this guy scores everything. Look at that angle. Look at that finish. Wow, dude. That was insane. Jeez, man. This card is ridiculous. All right, boys. We give him the last goal. I just wanted this guy to be able to have the win. I know how hard the objectives are, so I wanted him to have the win. Um, we were up 4-2. to two, So, yeah, I just wanted this guy to have the win and make sure that uh, he was getting that secured and all. Alrighty. Uh, next opponent, Hugo Sanchez Mbappe. 
Uh, Deli Alley. Red De Bruyne. Wow, dude. Wow, dude. Ronaldo with the ball of dreams to Bernardo Silva. Can he tuck it away? An assist already on the board. And my little baby. I love Bernardo. Let's go. Up 1-0, boys. We love to see it, man. It don't, yo, this kid, this team of the year kit almost looks like a top 100 kit. It's so funny. It, it looks so close to a top 100 kit. Oh, boy. Oh my god, what a goal. Alright, well, he hit one back that was insane on us. Certainly wanting to find a teammate, but he's just found an opponent. Socrates threads it through. Back post. Oh! <laughs> Whoops, that's a yikes for this guy. Very unlucky, man. He just didn't react quickly enough. He was... And what about Messi's first half, Alan? He's got himself a goal, but he does need a little bit of a helping hand. Oh my god. Wow, that defending was so good. Why is he be why would he be such a weirdo there and not drag his player over? Nice pass. Nice defending again, man. We get so close to scoring with Ronaldo twice there, just couldn't get it done. Oh my oh he tackled instead of shot. It's such a bug in the game, guys, when you click the B button out of a drag back. They tackle instead of shoot, man, because they don't register that they're on offense. All right, boys, that was a really tough game. The kits were combined. This guy played so slow. I've never played somebody. Actually, I played a ton of people play this slow, but that's going to be it for the Ronaldo review today. Yo, Ronaldo is, uh, is the real deal. He's really, really good, and I have to say, I kind of feel like this dude might... I think he's the best player in the game. Um, I feel like he's just a little bit better than Mbappe. He feels like he scores everything that you shoot with him. Which is a huge positive to the card. I feel like this card is kind of one of those cards you put in your team and you just get more wins in weekly because he's unstoppable. Kind of like the one last year where you just shot the first time shot with him and it went in. He's ridiculous. Uh, three goals and an assist in two games, but Rivals is a little bit harder to score than Champs. And I just think that he was a god. I, I really thought there was nothing really wrong with this card. I mean, I don't even know what I would tell you guys. He doesn't feel clunky. He has great passing. He has insane finishing. I thought his attack positioning was insane. I thought his biggest strength was his, was his, his strength ability. Like, I thought that, that was his... The, the best part about this card was his combination of agility and strength makes this dude unstoppable. He feels so freaking good in game. Um, so, I mean, it's a lot of coins, though. Seven million. But I think he's worth every penny. I didn't... It's not one of those cards I tried out like Messi where I was like, is this gold card really like that? Is this that much better than the gold card? This card feels miles above any Ronaldo version that I've used in this edition of FIFA. So thumbs up for that, boys. Thank you guys so much for watching today. I appreciate it a lot. Um, let me know in the comments what other reviews you guys want to keep seeing. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys soon. Peace out.